Last week we took a look at communion, and the reason we took a look at communion is because it's done so differently from church to church. Another area that is done differently from church to church is baptism. And right behind me you will see our baptismal that we use at our church. Why is it that baptism, which everyone feels is so important, is so different in every single church? It's done differently at the beginning for certain churches as far as the age of child. It's done differently for people as they come to salvation. It's just something that is looked at differently from each denomination. And yet, for whatever reason, it's also been something that has become very divisive in the church. Now, the original way that people were baptized and where baptism was actually written down about is in a book called the Didash. The Didash originally was looked at to be part of the Bible, but it was chosen not to be part of the canon because it wasn't written by an apostolic father. And because of that, and because there is no set guideline for us to turn to, it has been something that over the years has changed, and over the years people have chosen how to baptize and when to baptize. We're going to take a look at that this week, and what I challenge you with right now is just take a look as to why you were baptized, and if you were baptized, or if this is something that you have a desire to do. And hopefully by the end of the week, you'll be able to answer that question as we look into something that unfortunately is divisive in the church, and that is baptism.